Hello, I am Ashraf uh, from ICDRB. Yeah. I'll be very brief uh, in this presentation. Uh, now, <coughs> first, I will, I'm going to uh, describe the, how the, our uh, healthcare system in Bangladesh. Uh, it is basically, we have the admi different administrative structure. We have the eight divisions and uh, uh, 64 districts and opujalas. But also, uh, in, uh, other than the eight uh, divisions, we have the 12 city corporation, the largest cities are uh, the city corporation. And below the Upujala label, uh, there is also union and wards and uh, community clinic. Uh, our uh, comment, uh, diarrheal reporting basically through the district health information system, DHIS2, uh, covered the government uh, diarrhea covers. As I mentioned earlier, the, the AWD cases are covered uh, or uh, noticed or mentioned by the uh, government of Bangladesh and the Ministry of Health and Family Welfare, they developed this uh, health information system to gather all data in different levels. And since 2011, uh, DJHS uh, customized this DHIS2 version uh, and they covered the uh, information from the Upujala Health Complex uh, district level. These are the primary and secondary level and also the tertiary level uh, data uh, medical college hospitals. and. In different uh, uh, database at the central, they also cover the union level and community clinic level. And they cover the uh, different diseases, uh, following the disease information uh, uh, according to the ICD-10 code. Uh, and these all the information are uh, from different level of uh, uh, like health complex, uh, district level and medical college level, all uh, information. Uh, diarrhea information goes to the uh, uh, <coughs> district health in DHIS2 system in uh, centrally uh, and they could easily generate the daily reporting. And since uh, DG, uh, government of Bangladesh, they have the AWD uh, number. This is since 2012 they, and till now they uh, uh, maintaining this AWD cases reporting system. And from the uh, DGHS data set, we, we see that the uh, major uh, of the causes of the hospital admission under five level was uh, uh, in in the Upuchala Health Complex and district level. It is the highest number of cases uh, of diarrheal cases number. Almost uh, um, uh, almost 39 percent cases are uh, at the uh, Upuchala level and district level. Uh, almost 17 percent cases are the diarrheal cases. And uh, as I mentioned, our the uh, with the government of Bangladesh, I see will be uh, maintaining the cholera surveillance in 22 sites, and we do the uh, RDT in all the 22 sites. And also, uh, there are two um, paper published with a MGH group uh, where uh, we show that the 80 percent of the secondary infection cases uh, to the first cholera cases in the particular household level and 80% of the cholera infection were contracted within five days from the household member. And regarding the molecular uh, testing and genome, uh, whole genome sequencing, we have uh, uh, selected uh, some samples from the National Cholera Surveillance uh, for testing this whole genome sequencing uh, since 2014. And to understand the circulating vibrio cholerae at regional level in Bangladesh, utilizing the uh, fine resolution provided by the whole genome data. And this study data could be used in planning future surveillance strategy in this region, information, new epidemiology, and current outbreak strains. So in summary, the, this web-based uh, data collection system, DHIS2, to collect the routine health data uh, from the government health facilities of Bangladesh, and this provide the uh, ongoing health status outcome. And also it could uh, compare between the geographical location over time. But this uh, AWD data doesn't have any etiology of diarrheal disease, it's not available, nor details of patient uh, admission admitted. And also ICD hospital admissions are sent to the diarrheal control, uh, to the uh, government of Bangladesh, uh, all the patient information. And, and I mentioned that the, our the, uh, ICD and IEDCR, they are maintaining the uh, color surveillance and we do the RDT and IEDCR have the facility to do the culture and PCR 
and also I see review to the um, uh, Techman PCR and, and that's all. And uh, National Cholera Surveillance Control Plan, they also, uh, in, in the National Cholera Control Plan, they kept the culture uh, facility for the government level in a division, and also they plan to do the PCR and other things in the centrally. That's all. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, thank you.